this right here is the Red Rum, which is a Shining inspired bath bomb. And this is from that Glitter and Gore bath on Instagram and Finders Creepers on Etsy. Notice this is a giant red bath bomb. It's very highly scented that this will not stain skin, hair, or your tub, which I am very excited about because you can see why. This is a seven ounce bath bomb and it is scented in blood orange and strawberry. And one thing that I want to mention about the Finders Creeper Etsy store is all her products are highly scented. I could smell these in my mailbox before I even opened it. So you know that your bathroom is gonna smell amazing. And you can see she's actually got the red rum on there. And for those of you who do not know anything about that, Red rum is actually murder spelled backwards. So if you hold this in your mirror, it's actually gonna say murder. Let's get this started. Oh wow, a very fast reaction with fizz. I like this already. Now, it looks more orange on the camera, but it's actually red like blood. Let's add some holiday cheer. And you can see that this bath bomb is still going. It is not fizzed out. Let me see if I can. There's the left. And it already smells like the scent in here. And my water is fully colored now. And you can see there is some frost on this bath, which means it's got something in there which will make it cream up. And that's usually a product that's going to be good for your skin. And we are still fizzing along. It should be almost over with. We have just a penny size left. I am excited to get in this bath because her last bath product that I used, which was that Ouija board, smelled amazing and my skin was super hydrated afterwards. But the bathtub did not need any cleaning or anything after. I will definitely let you guys know if this stains anything after my bath. So I'm in and my skin feels super amazing. It's already silky smooth, but the good thing about her products is that they're not too overdone with products that make your skin soft so the tub does not become a slip and slide when you're done. I am looking at the water and noticing that it's actually colored highly, so when I scoop up some water, it's still red in my hand. The last bath bomb that I had used, which was the one that stained my tub, was one that was less colored than this, but the thing was, and where the damage was done, was when I got out of the tub, the bath bomb coloring was stuck to the bottom of my feet, and then I stepped on our carpet, and then I traced it into our living room and into our kitchen, and that's when I noticed I had something on me, and I touched it and wiped it on my face, and I had a big streak on my face, and all this was happening literally minutes before I had to leave for Halloween. And I just went with it. I was a witch with some blood stains, and then later on I came home, and it took two days of scrubbing to get that staining out of my skin. I still have no clue how to get it out of the tub or the carpet, so if you have any any recommendations, send them over. I'm willing to try them. So I am cleaning this up daily and still a stain. Mr. Ducky says that there will be no more bath staining with the Finders Creepers on Etsy. He's a little disappointed that the stain is still here from this other company, but he's very excited to find out there will be no more tub staining.